Today, you will learn how to make plaster dipped flowers to decorate a picture or a photo frame. We'll need quick set plaster of Paris and a mixing container, a plastic tray or waxed paper, some water, a spatula, a paintbrush, and some fabric flowers. We are going to wear gloves as the plaster powder might dry out the skin. Add a little bit of water at a time. Stir the mixture thoroughly but gently to avoid the creation of bubbles. Here's another tip. If you're working with plaster for a long time, use really cold water. The consistency we're going for is thin enough to evenly coat the petals of the fabric flowers. If the mixture turns out too thin, just add some more plaster powder. As the plaster mixture dries really quickly, make just enough to dip one or two flowers at a time. Now do everything really fast. Flip the flower over and dip it into the plaster mixture. Make sure each petal is perfectly coated. See? It's already hardening. Carefully shake off the excess plaster mixture and place it on the plastic tray or wax paper so you can peel off the flowers easily once they dry out. Brush any uncoated parts. Shape the flowers. We left the flowers to dry out overnight. Now, let's decorate a photo frame. The white ceramic-like flowers look really nice on the natural wood texture of the frame, so you might want to glue to attach the plaster-dipped flowers and just coat them with acrylic lacquer. We've decided to paint the frame for a yummy, creamy finish. First the frame, and the flowers. Paint thoroughly with a soft brush. You might also want to tint your plaster flowers by adding some food coloring or any other water-soluble pigment to the water before mixing it into the powder. The paint has dried. Arrange the flowers before attaching to the frame. Dab some hot glue and press to the frame surface till it cools down. Do the same with the rest of the flowers. Here we are! A perfect gift idea and an absolutely enjoyable craft. Subscribe to our channel for more home craft ideas.